How can you expect to attract relationships, situations, experiences that are favorable for you if you haven't even accepted or forgiven yourself for the unfavorable things you've done in your life and for the unfavorable feelings you permit yourself to feel? I have this thing where if a person isn't able to repent, I know a lot of people aren't religious, or just reflect on and forgive themselves and accept what it is they've been here, that person's going to be all fucked up emotionally. They're not going to be able to honestly hold on to whatever it is you're teaching them or modeling for them. They're going to constantly bring you down and zap, suck your energy out. It's not worth it. It's not worth relating to people who want to be in filth, in sin, and want to live according to their flesh, who, whose goals are to obtain material wealth and comfort in this physical world, right? I'm asking you to definitely get with something. Get with Yahweh. Look up Yahweh. Look up Yahusha Hamashiach. Get something, purify your spirit, purify your soul. And you all can say, oh, I'm speaking out the side of my neck or whatever, but I know the reality of what the hell is going on here. And it would be just so poor of me. I wouldn't be a leader. I wouldn't be anything I say I am if I did not come on and share this wisdom with you because it would be who of us who are wise and uh, confident and humble enough to get on here put ourselves on the line and share information with you and i'm going to get into that information this uh week i'm very busy aside from that you have to be right with yourself none of your relationships are going to work unless you're right with yourself no matter how amazing a person can be someone literally just told me i'm just like the next female i know you guys are laughing on the other side of the screen because it's absolutely absurd and ridiculous and pray for that person but it's just honestly insane insane how people can function and focus in this world and just be oblivious to what is real because they're operating by their emotions and that's my other message for today peace